Hi everyone, welcome back. For today's Manny, we're going to be using dip powders from Madkin Beauty to create a fun, bright Manny. And then we're also going to be using a full coverage decal sheet for an accent nail. We're going to be doing the gel method and we're going to dive right into these colors here. We're starting with Walking on Sunshine. And Walking on Sunshine, it's a beautiful, bright neon yellow and it's pretty amazing and it's pretty bright and it also glows in the dark but if you are looking for like that high voltage neon yellow walking on sunshine is gonna be the color because it is super bright so i'm gonna go ahead and cure that for 30 seconds and after i cure it i'm gonna go ahead and brush it off and then we're gonna go ahead and do another coat and you can see there i was like totally checking out that nail because i was like shocked on how full coverage that was with just one dip. After I go in with that second layer of gel base, I'm gonna go ahead and dip it into that jar again and we got more pigment now and just more vibrancy with walking on sunshine. It is stunning and the color yellow is just very bright and it's that electric bolt yellow. All right, so going into citrus swirl here. Now this is a really pretty shimmery orange. It's screaming summer and I really like how it's like this bright orange and then it has these like really fine glitter mix to it and this color right here would look really pretty as like a sugared nail as well. But this is just one dip and you're going to see that shimmer and that color pigment really shine through on that second dip. So I am curing off camera for 30 seconds. So when you see me go ahead and brush that right away, just know that I did cure that nail for 30 seconds and then I go ahead and brush that off. But check out that second dip. It is gorgeous. And wouldn't this be like super pretty like as a sugared nail? I think it would be really fun. I'm going to have to try that, but citrus swirl is definitely the perfect name for this. And then this Mandy would not be complete without a beautiful bright pink. So we're going in with pink flamingo here. And when I'm doing the gel method, I always start with the gel product in the middle of the nail and then I work its way up. But wait till you see this color right here. Isn't it pretty? And it has like almost like a blue sheen to it with the sparkle. It's very pretty and it's a very fine glitter. But I do just want to gently tap that extra glitter down just to make sure it's laying really flat. And this will help cut down any filing and buffing. I really like the gel method with the Madkin Beauty dip powders because the end result, since the powders are super finely milled, I'm going to have less filing and buffing to do. And to be honest, I did not have to buff this Manny at all. You're going to see all I had to do was clean up the sides of the Manny with a file. I'm sorry, of the nail with a file. And that's all I had to do for this Manny. So these powders are super finely milled. And look at that color payoff with that second dip. Pink Flamingo is everything. And I just really like the touch of sparkle that we added to this Manny with Pink Flamingo and then Citrus Swirl. I just think these colors are so fun. And I really wanted like a bright summer Manny. And I just thought that these colors would really just bring the summerness that I need in my life. So here's the Manny so far. It's looking good with those three colors, but we're going to add just one layer of white diamond. This is a pure white dip powder from Mac and Beauty. This is going to be the nail that we're going to use for an accent nail to apply that full coverage decal wrap to. So I only wanted to do one dip just to have like a white background to really make the colors on that decal sheet pop. And this white is full coverage. And then the last bright color we're going to add to this Manny, it needed a pop of lime green. So we're going in with key lime and this is such a gorgeous green. It is vibrant. It is everything. And it's just like the perfect neon green and key lime pie is definitely the perfect name for this green because it is giving me all those limes kind of vibes and I'm totally loving this green here so much. I love yellows lately and bright greens. I'm all about them and this one just has like the most like beautiful undertone to it. It has like a yellow undertone almost like a hint of like that walking on sunshine undertone but it's super pretty. So here's the Manny as it is without the decal and now we're going to jazz it up. We're going to go ahead and bust out the McCart nail transfer foil glue. Now this is 
something that you apply just like you would with your gel base or your gel top coat and you cure it for 60 seconds. So while that's curing, I got that decal there in the water and we're just going to take that out with some tweezers, put it on a lint-free wipe to let some of that water absorb. I'm going to take a jelly stamper. <clears throat> I find that using a jelly stamper is a little bit easier to place the decal and to remove that backing. And then I'm just gonna dab it on that lint-free wipe to remove any extra water. And since we put that McCart transfer foil glue and cured it for 60 seconds, what that McCart transfer foil does, it allows a very sticky surface to that nail to help adhere this decal to lay it super flat to the nail. Now to remove that extra excess from that decal sheet, we're gonna use acetone and this flat brush. And we're gonna dip this flat brush into the acetone acetone and we're going to carefully remove the extra decal that is hanging over this nail and I'm just going to carefully go in and get that brush wet and just dab it along the sidewalls and the free edge and then the, act, the extra decal is just going to dissolve off and you just want to be careful in making sure that you're dabbing with a light hand and that your brush isn't too saturated so you are not dissolving any of that decal that is on that nail. So that is how I remove the extra length of a decal and then if you have any small wrinkles or anything like that on the top of the decal you can also go ahead and gently tap that brush of acetone on that nail to smooth out any lines and then right away I'm going to seal in this decal to make sure that it doesn't move or lift or anything like that with a gel base and I'm going to cap the free edges and then I'm going to cure that for 30 seconds while that's curing this is all the filing that I had to do that I mentioned earlier. All I'm doing is cleaning up the free edge and the sidewalls there and the cuticle line. And that is all I had to do with these powders. They laid super flat and they were super smooth on that nail. And then to finish up this mani, I'm going to go in with my top coat. Now that little bottle holder that you see here that that top coat is placed, that is from Liquid Layers. I do get a lot of questions on where that's from. I do have a discount code in the description box below with the link to Liquid Layers. There's so many different colors as well. But we finished up this mani with top coat and I cured it for 60 seconds. And here's the finished mani. It is so pretty. I really like the pops of color. And then we have this really fun tie-dyed like cheetah leopard print decal as an accent nail and it kind of ties in all those colors together. I just really like how it turned out. I think it's really pretty with the pops of color and that citrus um, swirl. Isn't that gorgeous with that glitter? It just really is so pretty and I really like we, how we have two pops of glitter in this nail and then we have two salads and then we have that fun decal nail. I just think it's really fun and it turned out really nicely and these powders performed amazingly and you got to see these colors in action and how they applied with the gel method and they applied really nicely. You can see that that yellow is definitely very bright. It's not patchy. Sometimes yellow with the gel method can look a little splotchy or you could have like darker sections or like splotches on the nail from the gel method after curing but that did not happen with walking on sunshine so gel method worked amazing with this color but I will go ahead and link everything that we use in today's Manny in that description box below and I'll see you all in the next upload.